my iTechnology reviewers, we got two memory cards, two micro SD memory cards of SanDisk because SanDisk is uh, in the best producers of micro SD and SD and uh, other compact flashes uh, cards for video recording, for images, for smartphones. And these memory cards, we have the models Ultra and the Extreme. And the not, a, not a lot of people know that the extreme memory cards from SanDisk compared to the Ultra or other uh, standard uh, memory cards has a special silicone layer that will protect you from the water for, um, uh, for example or will protect you from other shocks. It's more resistant than other, uh, than other video cards. So I'm very curious of these two memory cards. How is the speed? Because if you see here, it says 48 megabytes per second. So 48 megabytes at ultra and the extreme. We know the extreme, you will need a USB 3.0 memory card reader for achieving those 48 megabytes per second. I don't know at the SanDisk Ultra and I'm very curious if we will achieve 40, not 48, for example, because the, there is a difference in extreme uh, and in ultra SanDisk uh, cards. These both cards have a 10 year warranty from the producer. So uh, some uh, cards, some SD cards came with a recovery software. In these cards, I see ideal for Android, Power and other smart tablets. So now, for example, we have the Note 4, the Note 5, the Note 3 records 4K. So at 4K, you will need some uh, high quality speed cards and Extreme, you will not have problems with SanDisk Extreme, for example, because it will uh, have 45 to 48, like the producer says, and this uh, speeds we will test them i will test i tested before a lot of cars from sandisk we work we work with sandisk extreme in video production to not risk anything and uh, until now sandisk didn't let us down and as long as the technology will progress you will need high speed cards so let's test them so for our first test is the ultra micro sd card and we'll copy a file of 1.2 gigabytes and let's see from a SSD. And so we formatted a memory card in XFAT and it's still 5 6 megabytes per second. It's kind of lame. Now we will format it in NTFC in quick format and we're going Let's see. So the first format was unsuccessful. Now the second, it works. It's something strange with this memory cards. Let's copy again that file and we'll gain a lousy 5 megabytes per second at the copying. So this is not right. So now we'll copy from micro SD card to C. And let's see. Okay. And it copies with 15 megabytes per second. The copying is okay. Uh, we copied now a 500 uh, megabytes of uh, file. And uh, 60 megabytes per second is the maximum of for this card. Now we formatted the 64, the extreme micro SD from SanDisk, the 64 gigs. So now we'll copy that uh, 600 megabytes of file. So the difference between Ultra and Extreme is 2 megabytes. 2 maybe 3 megabytes per second. So in this case we have 8 megabytes per second. And now we're gonna copy the file from microSD to the, S, to the SSD. And let's see. And the copying, the copying is, oh, it get it a boost first, 22 megabytes per second, so it's not that 48 megabytes per second, but, you 
know, it's the half. <laughs> And the stable 22 megabytes per second at copying. So yes, it's better, but it's not what SanDisk says. Um, at copying, we managed to achieve on the SD uh, cards from SanDisk 45, 48 megabytes per second. So at the micro SD. Mm. Now we have a Samsung micro SD 16 gigs with class 6 and let's see and I can see uh, 4 megabytes 5 the beginning was a little boosted but it's the same as SanDisk Ultra so the class 10 of uh, Samsung uh, we will not test them but I will perhaps will be, I suppose will be 8 to 9 megabytes as the SanDisk Extreme. So the memory cards are the same. So it speeds up to 48 megabytes per second. Mm, I don't think so. Even at reading we get 22 megabytes per second. So it's a difference and I sense a difference comparing Ultra SanDisk with uh, extreme SanDisk micro SD and it's a difference. What I discovered that this extreme micro SD has written free but it's not class free and this uh, ultra has written 10 but at both packages has written the class 10 and I have no idea what this free means I suppose it's class 10. So I hope that you'll get for your tablets, your phones, the best card which will give you performance. So our recommendation is extreme. But test Samsung micro SD cards, test Kingston cards, because uh, you will never know. Until then, uh, we hope we can give you some results with uh, with these cards. But you know, you can expect a lot of performance for micro SD cards. We are iTechnology Reviews. You got to love technology because technology is part of our lives. You guys, thumbs up. Up. Bye.